All right, we'll carry on here with Waterloo, but before we do, I want to make uh, note of these objectives. Before the end of the game, which is turn 40, like I said, the Allied Army is demoralized, so we have to give them 75% losses, which is coming up. But the key thing is the next one, the French Army is not demoralized, 60% losses. And then do not lose the Napoleon, which <laughs> we lost them the last, last game. That's when we had to restart is because... Uh, Number one, I didn't know which one of these generals was Napoleon. I didn't know they were actual. I didn't know it was as detailed as the game was, so got a little careless. And uh, secondly, they got they squeezed off a long-range artillery round and took them out. And when you see these leaders, they have an entourage around them. I mean, they have a like a a three or a four number. I think most of them are three, so they have like thirty men with them. So uh, they have to take a few hits before you finally get to the leader. You have to hit the their guard, wear them down. But uh, this is key here. I need to pull my army back, and we cannot suffer any more losses. So let's see if we can get here with it. Let me, yeah, there you go. All right, well, I cannot move anyone else. Let me see, make sure I don't. We cannot suffer too many more losses, so that is key. It is the British turn. I got my spectacles on because I can't see that small. <laughs> All right, I guess it's ready for their turn. Nothing else we can do. Let's listen and look. Oh, I see somebody moving right here. Oh, let me turn that down. Let me turn that down. Sorry about that. All right, we're going far. Oh, they destroyed my unit. What else is going on here? Oh, you destroyed my, uh, we're going down. I don't know where all this is coming from. All this is coming from up here. Yeah, so far I got three units that just got destroyed. What I didn't want to do, so we could be losing this game right away. All right, there's ten units fired in the Hougamont. There goes some cannon fire. Well, I hear more cannon fire. Here they go, moving. Moving to protect his, uh, units. Wise policy, wise policy. Oh, he's firing at him. My cavalry's taking hits. Oh, firing at my cavalry left and right. Do I got a leader that's exposed down here? Looks like I do. Oh, and it's my turn. So he hasn't got much to do. These turns are going by quick. At the beginning of the game, it'd take a full 15 minutes for our turn. So that is good. Let me, uh, Go around here. Yeah, we cannot lose our army, so we got to pull back. Oh, he went ahead on in here, didn't he? Ah, uh, not good. We have nine units here. I definitely want to pull into these buildings. Oh, can we move here? No, we can't move here. Oh, sorry about that. We will move into here. These five will move into here. My leader will move into. I want to move in with these guys, but I guess not. Ah, now we got it all bogged up. Okay. My leader back in that here. They own it right here, but I didn't, I didn't want them to get in there, but they got in there. I will hold that. Uh, we don't want to get, we don't want to lose anybody, so let's move back here. A blocking force. Let my artillery do the rest. Any other targets? No. That's good for now. Some of these cavalry could take care of them. We got other plans for them. Take care of this stuff here. And like I said, oh, let's move these boys on back. We want to fire at these boys here. The Hello Saint. 
This is he's strong through here. We gotta I don't know what to do. I need to limber up my artillery and get out of here or what? Let's all fire and see if we can't destroy this unit with nothing but by mass artillery fire. Oh, not a good way to start. Yep, that's the only thing we could do, boys and girls. Use the artillery. We'll take it all day long. All right. Massive artillery fire still within range. Good deal. Oh, took a mess. Last battery, and he still can shoot from long range. Another mess. We're going to wear them now before we fire on them. Look at all my artillery's facing that way. Yep, that's what it's there for. All right, let's see if we can get some more artillery. All right, more artillery in here. Fire it away. Oh, he nailed 20 with that sucker. Let's go again. A mess. Is that it? Oh no. Alright. Let's see what we can do. These boys here are going over to. Uh... Ah, I didn't want to do that. Shh, hit the wrong button. Alright. We want to melee. Let's see what we can do here. They're getting out of the way. General, can he? Nope, he can't merge. Need to get him right here, though. Here's Napoleon back here. I got him safely back there. I learned my lesson. All right, we got a bunch more artillery here. Can it help us out? No, it cannot. Not yet. Well, let's see here. We got a shot here. Miss. Nah, we're going to be wasting it. Alright, we'll keep these guys limbered. Or unlimbered, ready to go. Ain't much going on with them, but we do have something going on around here with Hougamont. And we'll get to the interesting cavalry charge here in a second, but right now, we'll just get these guys here. These little boys will fire, try to eliminate, take some fire from my compound. To the boys outside. <coughs> no good, no good. Pretty nice if we can get a merge going on here. Go ahead and merge. Oh, can't do that. There's only 10 of them? Yep, there's only 10 of them. We don't want to be doing nothing with them. Like I said, we don't want to be used, losing any units. Let's see if we can't merge these boys together here. Uh, let's go. Uh, we make a move, so we are back. Okay, well, my artillery, they're all limbered. They're heading down this way. They're heading east from the left flank, flank to the white, right flank. Easy for me to say. Uh, and if we need them down here in the center, they'll be fine, but they're, they're getting mobile. And right now, we're going to move this unit here on the Hougamont Courtyard. We're going to fire us off a little shot here. Leader versus leader. Oh, I thought they could shoot. They can't shoot. Oh, no. They cannot. Huh. All right. Well, so much for that. Uh, you're in the blue. Let me see what I want these guys to do. I think I'll leave them like they are. We got cavalry up. Now it's time for the cavalry. Yeah, it's time for my blue boys. Boys flashing blue. Oh, if I can get down in here. All right, he's bringing them out to meet him, but I think it's going to be too late. I need to get rid of some of these easy, low-hanging fruits. Let's see what we can do. Ooh, can't reach them, can't reach them. Can reach this one here, though. We'll take what we can get. Coming from this way. See you later. Yeah, that's what this is all about. All right, this could be a game changer up here. Let's see if we can't get any more. You gotta be kidding me. All right, well, what are we crashing at? Up north.
Let me think much. We need to get up north, though. Or out west. Up is sideways. Sideways is up. Or up. Ooh, hard to get them going, but we'll go. Follow them on through. Follow them on through. Leader can go to all the way up here. All right, what we're, we're trying to do is get these guys on around up here and start clearing out if anything comes up around here. It'll be a big threat this way. Like I said, we're kind of trying to get them up around here. They'll dive in here. The rest of these can take care of what they got in front of them. So they're off. All kinds of batteries here to be had. Six, four, six. We will go for the one that is closest. We'll come this way. And the hell, this one. Nope. But whatever, as long as it takes them out. Ooh, and my boys bail. Suffer some casualties. All right, we got more. We got more. Oh, no, they can't reach. Not good. Uh, will they be able to survive? Uh, these guys will all fire at them, hunters only. There's six of them. I want to save these. So they will go back here behind some hedgerows and take some cover. What else we got? Alright, let me see what I want to do with the rest of these. We'll be right back. Alright, well, I got these guys in way too close. And they're only ten. But I can go try making up a sacrifice. They ain't going to do nothing. They're just going to get uh, chewed up, I don't think, without taking anybody with them so we want to definitely get them out of here because we don't want to lose any points we don't want our general to be in there all by himself either so we have him up here we probably should merge him in with the unit all right that's what we're gonna do there oh hard to get to him hard to get to him let me see what i'll do with the rest of these flashing blue cavalry units be back all right well, he's got this nice little hedgerow block it's blocking my cavalry. I really can't get to it. I don't want to go down this way because he's got squares. And by the time we get through the gauntlet, we'll be losing. So our only route is to go this way. Let me get this centered a little bit better. Uh, how do you move this? Go? Okay. Yeah, so we have to take this route up through here, crash down, and come around this way. It's the only way we can go. The head rows. Hedgerows are definitely to his advantage. Oh, we don't want to get too shot up, though. Oh, he can't. He can't get too close either. Oh, what do we do with these boys? Don't want to do that. Don't want to get it down there. Cavalry to come, we'll be right back. Alright, so I got a choice here. This little group of cavalry here on more of the eastern side of my right flank. A big target would be just to come on in here, but again, these hedgerows are killing me with these units. So I have to come down this hill and then up towards them. They might they might maul. That might be what happened in history. <laughs> so we're gonna play it safe. I don't want to lose my units. If I it's just that we can't lose any more units, I don't want to lose sixty percent of my army. So we are not going to take advantage and attack here. I, that's what I really want to do, is throw these guys here at him. I got more behind them, and just go in here and maul. But I have a feeling they'd be uh, them mauling me, so we will bypass and head more up here. If these guys want, they can get frisky, come after my cannons, and when they're crossing this open ground, we'll just wear them out, we'll just blow them away. That's what, I'm, that, that's what these guys' fate are. We're waiting for it to get loosened up, get froggy, come across this open area. But uh, all my infantry is coming down here to the hell of I got all my other fronts covered. Yeah, these boys here need to just get 
Just ignore them and come on up. We'll be right back. All right, then that's what we're going to end up doing. We will bypass this here and head my cavalry on up. Something tells me this is going to get really interesting and need to bury that score a little bit more, but if I could save my army, I don't see no uh, reinforcements or anybody coming in, so I don't know what's up with this battle. If it's 40 turns long, we ain't even halfway. So we will have to see what's up. Something's telling me, uh, hopefully my forces have not been decimated, but we haven't lost yet, so we will click on to the uh, next turn. Let me look everything over and make sure I'm ready to proceed with the British turn. We'll be back. Alright, back to Wellington's victory in my Waterloo game. And, uh, I didn't know this computer was that loud. My apologies. So hopefully it's a little bit quieter now, but I noticed on some of those videos that thing was cranking. And I don't hear it that loud either that or I need to get my ears cleaned. But, uh, we are on a key turn in this game. And it's turn 16. And it's key because if you come all the way down here to my right flank, all the way far east. Ooh, we got a general. Our unit just came onto the scene. And it will be Blucher. And it is strange that he would appear without nobody around him. That he'd be the first one to uh, get onto the map. Luckily for him, I don't have any units that are close by that can deal with them. But, uh, yeah. There'll be a new, uh, new sheriff in town. <laughs> and we gotta deal with the Prussians. They're here. We'll be back. <laughs> 